Anyway, boycott was playing here on one occasion um, for Yorkshire against Middlesex. Um, and it was near the end of his career, thank God. Uh, and uh, he walked out of that, and it, 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 Angus Fraser was bowling for, it, for Middlesex, the famous one in England bowler. And he was a young bowler at the time with a few words of his own. And he beat Boycott a couple of times early on in, in the first over, and you know, sort of went, oh, you know, what, what, what are you using? A, a toothpick or something. And Boycott was, you know, my whip could bat against you, and all this, you know, the usual sort of stuff. Um, he hit a couple of twos in the first ten overs. <laughs> anyway, so go, look at that, good technique, you know, uh, lovely timing, you know, footwork, <laughs> and uh, 12 months out to lunch. <laughs> so, uh, come out after lunch, there's more of this sort of stuff about technique, and uh, I couldn't really reach that with a clothes prop, he said at one point, when looked at him, I was like, why am I? And it was just constant commentary, you can't shut the bloke up. Um, <laughs> 25 months out of 10. <laughs> somebody, somebody on the field said he wouldn't have a stroke. Um, and uh, anyway, just after 10, um, he was 32 from four and a half hours batting. And Fraser's bowling another book over from this pavilion end, and he nips one down the slope into Boycott's pads. So it's probably missing leg by six, seven inches, you know, a decent amount, missing leg by a good distance. Anyway, Fraser goes up, all the fielders go up, the whole crowd up, even the people on the Yorkshire balcony. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway, Boycott's um, confident it's, it's not out, obviously, but we had a good character at the time called Arthur Jepson, the umpire, who looked, he had these massive sticky out ears, he looked a bit like the FA Cup staying out. And anyway, he, he sensed the moment too, he had a, bit of a good sense of humour, anyway, he said, that's out, get him out. So Boycott stared, completely dumbfounded for once. But as he was at the far end, he had to walk back past the umpire to, to the pavilion. So as he went past Jepson, he just whispered under his breath, Hey Arthur, why don't you guide dog? <laughs> so quick as a flash, uh, Jepson said, I got rid of it for yapping, same as I'm doing you. Now, <laughs> 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 